Hey guys, how are you? Another interesting video. This topic comes from Danish. Uh, he's a user of my apps and I've actually created a video before answering questions from Danish and um, I usually like to say Danish loves the apps. Uh, I think that's just my thing that I say whenever I answer somebody's question. But anyway, Danish had some issues with his hosting and, it, and I have had issues with my hosting as well and it's hosting for the website. And um, it's frustrating. And one thing Danish said is maybe I'll um, host it by myself. Maybe I'll just host on my own, right? Instead of using another hosting company, like there's a million hosting companies, they all pretty much do the same thing. Um, and so I really wanted to make a video explaining why you should not ever host on your own. Um, because it's really simple. Hosting companies have been hosting sites for 20 years now and they are extremely good at it even if they have problems sometimes. The thing is that if you host your own website, it's totally doable. It, is not, it isn't all that hard if your site is basic. But the problem is that, the thing is that you really don't want to be doing that. What you want to be doing is spending every effort of your working hour on growing your business and not maintaining the servers. So let the hosting companies do that for you. They're really good and generally for what they do, they're extremely cheap. Um, so that's just a really quick video. I mean, you don't want to be stuck with this server maintenance nightmare. I mean, this is going to be a nightmare that's going to, and problems are always going to pop up. Like firewall is down. The spammers are trying to hack our server, whatever, like, like a million things. And the, the hosting companies, they got it all figured out for the most part. Um, we do not. Like general people, like we haven't had that to have to work with it. And it's like, it's just, that, that's just something that's done for us. And if you try to host on your own, uh, there's going to be an unimaginable number of problems that we'll have to fix that you don't, we don't even think about those problems because the hosting companies take it, take care of them for us. But it is kind of complicated dealing with the networking and things like that and the servers. So you really do, you really want to do, I mean the server networking, not like business networking. So really what, what you want to do is use a hosting company. Um, so that's it. Uh, I hope that was insightful and helpful and yeah, don't host on your own. This is going to be a huge mistake and actually uh, you may think, you know, if you're an experienced like website owner, you, you understand that you got to use a hosting company. But I do hear from new entrepreneurs often that they are not sure whether they should host on their own or they should like get a hosting company. But this is a mistake because this is one of the no-brainer things. Just use a hosting company. Don't think twice about it because for the price we pay and what we get, it's an incredible thing. Um, and I'm glad that they are there because I certainly don't want to be dealing with server issues when I'm growing my business, which has nothing to do with server issues. Um, anyway, so that's it. I hope that was helpful. Please subscribe to the channel. And of course, if you are starting a business, check out my business apps. They cover business ideas, business planning, marketing, and fundraising. And they're available on iOS, Android, Kindle, or problemio.com. Or if you search for Problemio in any of those app stores. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.